What it do guys, it's your boy All with Sniper here back with another video and in this one we're gonna be showing you guys how to lock up them Cavaliers because I know you're tired of people playing with Golden State, Cavaliers, Spurs, Thunder, I know you're tired of playing all those teams so this video right here is gonna show you how to lock up them Cavaliers, best defensive settings so before we even jump into the video hit that like button, hit the subscribe button for more videos like this and let's jump right into this thing man all right guys first things first just like i start off all of my defensive uh all right guys first things first just like i start off all of my defensive settings videos go to your coaching settings and make sure that adapt adapting coaching engine is off oh my god i couldn't speak right there but make sure that it's off and let's go ahead and jump right into the settings itself so, so the best team to play against the warriors i mean the cavaliers honestly you honestly the or, you know obviously the Warriors but you can play with them, the Spurs the Bucks the Thunder you know I don't even have a problem beating the Cavaliers to be honest because they don't have shooters they're not like the Warriors they don't have shooters they can just shoot lights out so basically all you gotta do is leave this these two just like last video automatic automatic leave these two automatic you force direction you want to force them to the middle and that is because lebron james is so op when he goes baseline it's a it's an automatic dunk every time your help is in the middle and remember that your help is in the middle d wade is not a threat derrick rose is not a threat and when i say they're not a threat i mean they're not a threat from that three-point line because anything in that paint all you do is gotta you see this button right here hold it up all you do is gonna put your hands up and I mean, they, I mean, of course they're gonna make some of those little lucky layups. They might even call fouls, but they're, you're containing them. It's better to contain the team than just get overpowered by them all, all the way. So put force direction in the middle. On ball, you can go under with them, catch hedge, go under, catch hedge. And the reason because Isaiah is their point guard, he can shoot, but he's short, so you can get to the shot. If, if he calls for the pick and roll with Dwayne Wade, he can't shoot lebron james he can't shoot not off the screen they're not going to be shooting like the warriors off the screen in people's faces you guys know what i'm talking about with the calves you really you really don't want to switch with the calves off ball off ball make sure you go under the screen post you want to go three three fourth tops and that's because you want to get the steal you do not want a mismatch with kevin love or it's Tristan Thompson because if someone really knows how to use that paint game like me, boy, you are getting destroyed. Switch rules, switch all. I always do switch all. But if he has a, a big lineup in like Tristan Thompson, switch guards. And screen help rules on the Cavaliers, you can do help and no rotation. You can do do help and no rotation on the screen rules and on the drive rules leave it automatic that is because sometimes you don't want the help but sometimes you do want the help that's why i don't put help in no rotation because they always will help but if you put no help then they don't help at all but if you really want them to help off a specific person you could put this that help in no rotation help in no rotation and then whoever you want them to help off of like say you want them to help off Dwayne wade which i do leave him what i tell y'all about draymond green leave him they're not going to be consistent shooters and they're going to get annoyed by them missing three so they're going to stop shooting leave him they will leave the defender and they're going to be wide open i mean leave them wide open the way way can only shoot jump shots he is not a three-point threat but if he tries to cut they will stop him make sure when you guard kevin love you put stay attached because a lot of people will do the pick and pop with Kevin Love. Another thing, guys, on Kevin Love, make sure your drive help is on automatic. And same thing for Tristan Thompson. Make sure your drive help is on automatic. And then lastly, put Derrick Rose on leave him off ball because you want that extra help for when LeBron James try to bully his way into that paint. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. And for the centers, you can really leave gaps on these people or put it to moderate because they shoot slow. They really shoot really slow and you can easily contest. But if you don't want, if you don't even want them to get the three off, you know, leave it automatic. I mean, yeah, leave it automatic. And even if you want, if you want to get even more aggressive, where is it at? Put your extended pressure on. This will 
this will cause a lot of turnovers this will cause a lot of turnovers because they're going to be trying to run up the court real fast past you because they think it's you playing that when you do extended pressure the computer will automatically guard isaiah thomas full court no matter what they're going to think it's you they're going to try to rush the ball up the court and it causes a lot of turnovers but if against somebody real good you, know, you want to turn that thing to automatic or turn it off but turn it on if they're not a really good player lastly on the end game when you get into the game, wait till I get on uh, defense. Actually, I'll just let him get the jump ball. Press that right D-pad and go to focus on play physical on aggressing. Focus, shrink the floor. Because they're not really good shooters. Some people, though, some people can shoot with these calves. So when you see that, make sure you take off that. Make sure you take off that defensive set. Make sure you take off that defensive setting. Just do straight up. And that'll be it, guys. I mean, these defensive settings work. You know, my record is really, really good online. I really honestly only lost two games, three games. It's only two or three games, but I lagged out a couple. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Share this video. Hit that subscribe button for more videos on tips and tricks on 2K. We'll also be doing full gameplays. You know, and I'm also going to be showing you guys ways to win money off of that website because I'm going to be continuing doing tournaments and doing leaderboard games off of worldgaming.com. If you guys have not seen that video, I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want to win money off of playing 2K. But, you know, only gamble if you're good at the game. Do not gamble money on, on that website if you're not good at the game. Please don't. So, without further ado... I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. I got a big amount. I took a different route. I am the pick or the little. I was a juvie. It gave me community. I had to pick up some little. Uh, I want it easy. Please do not tease me. I want my Yeezy to do them. Uh, this is the season. I got the season. Don't make me sprinkle you niggas. Uh, I got my reason. You want to please me. Send me the pussy, not pictures.